Hello everyone, I hope you are well. Today I will discuss about bandwidth marks or load balancing with failover by Microtik router. I am Marafat on behalf of GreenTechRevolution.com. I will configure load balance. There are two ISP here. ISP1, ISP2. ISP1 give the provide the IP address 104.10.1.2 subnet mask gateway and 2MB bandwidth ISP2 provide IP subnet gateway and 2MB bandwidth and LAN 192.160.1.1.24 ISP1 ISP1 2MB and ISP2 2MB Mars bandwidth Mars will be 4MB equal 4 MB okay I'll configure now enter router IP then address click this IP address put this one I ISP one IP address 104.10.1.2 slash 24 SP1 okay. Okay, start IP address plus click then two zero two one nine one twenty dot two two zero two dot one nine one dot twenty dot two slash twenty four select ISP two apply ok then IP then route click get in 104.10.1.1 first ISP ok get in then second ISP get in 202.191 dot 20 dot 1 but fill up check it a pin check it a pin ok apply ok already reachable to SP are reachable then put IP address LAN IP address IP address click here LAN IP address 192.168.1.1 slash 24 192.168.1.1 slash 24 select it at LAN apply ok IP firewall net then chain source net 192.168.1.0 slash 24 must be local address here action must give it apply ok ok then IP firewall net 10 chain chain source net out interface ISP1 action must be apply ok then IP firewall net Click plus general from chain source net out interface ISP2 action must be it. Apply OK. Then IP firewall. Net IP 
spiral but mangle root balance create ko uh, i'll create root balance mangle plus chain input chain input then in interface in interface isp1 select isp1 action mark connection mark connection new connection mark isp1 put right isp1 isp1 pass to apply okay same ip firewall mangle click plus general chain input in interface isp2 action mark connection connection new connection mark ISP two, ISP two. Apply OK. Then IP firewall mangle. Take plus here. General from chain output. Output connection mark. Connection mark ISP one. Connection mark ISP one. Action mark routing. Mark routing. New routing mark ISP one. Apply OK. Again, IP firewall mangle. Then click plus general output connection mark ISP two. Then action mark routing new. Routing mark ISP two ISP two. Then apply. Okay. Input and output already finished. Then IP routes. Plus gateway one zero four dot ten dot one dot one mm, ISP one gateway ISP one gateway okay routing mark. Routing mark ISP one. Okay. Apply. Okay. Again, IP routes. Then click plus. Then gateway. ISP two. ISP two gateway. This gateway. Two zero two. Dot one nine one. Twenty dot one. Then routing mark ISP two. Apply. Okay. Okay. Then my put IP address in my PC. Okay, local IP address one nine two two one six eight dot one. 
so 10 you get a it's local IP address okay now I'm getting internet okay I'm getting internet okay now control the bandwidth 2 MB 2 MB 2 MB bandwidth 2 MB bandwidth but equal will be passed through 4 MB in land side okay then create queue queue isp1 isp1 target ip address 104.10.1.1.2 slash 24 ok that's network address ok 2 MB upload and download 2 MB apply ok then create ISP2 target address 202.191.20.2 2MB 2MB upload and download ISP2 IP ok apply ok then LAN plus create local LAN target IP address which IP address 192.168.1.1 ok wall LAN ok 190 192.168.1.0.24 all block on on block network address then 4 MB I will get 4 MB 2 MB 2 MB 4 MB ok apply ok Okay, now I'll download here. Okay. Already traffic already four MB. 2 MB, 2 MB, 4 MB, passing through 4 MB. Okay, I'll get 4 MB. Already I'm getting 4 MB in LAN site, from LAN site, okay. But interface 2 MB, 2 MB. Already 2 MB, 2 MB. ISP 1, 2 MB. ISP 2, 2 MB. Then equal 4 MB. 4 MB, okay. Equal 4 MB. I'll get 4 MB. Okay, 2 MB, 2 MB, 4 MB passing through 4 MB land site is called load balance with failover. Okay, IP route. Then one ISP will be down. Then automatically another ISP will up and bandwidth marks and load uh, passing through land site in double bandwidth ok thank you for watching see the next video please subscribe now for next video